Hola amigos, I am here to do a video that I have not done in a long time. I can't speak. I cannot enunciate my words. I am doing a video that I haven't done in a long time and the reason why I haven't done it in a long time is just because I feel that the series it's just the same thing that I can get but I decided to do a little bit of digging and I am bringing back my $1 eBay hauls. So if you guys don't know, this is like one of my more popular videos. It's where I go on eBay and I buy things for a dollar shipped. So it's either 99 cents. I do not go over the threshold of a dollar and that is with free shipping. So this is pretty much uh, everything that I can get. I try and not buy the same things over and over again. In no particular order, just FYI, when you guys order stuff on eBay, it takes like anywhere from three to six to nine weeks for delivery, which is why it takes forever for me to come pile all of these things in this bin so yes all right let's get into it the first thing that i have are actually these lashes and they're a little bit longer than i uh thought they were going to be but i'm guessing that it can be set up for like and cut them down to size and if you guys don't know it's a it's a known hack to get your lashes off of ebay just because you can get so much for a dollar like this is one of the smaller packs Next thing that I have is actually this bookmark. It's actually pretty cool. I have a book. Let me show you guys. You bookmark like so, and then it points to where you left off at so you don't lose where you left off at. So that's pretty cool. Okay, the next thing that I have is actually a hair styling type of kit. There's that. So this makes it so I can do a bun, a little twisty. It comes with a comb. It's a little set for a dollar, which I thought wasn't bad not bad at all I can never have too much stuff when it comes to hair stuff okay the next thing I have is actually this really cute choker it might seem like a lot but honestly it's actually pretty cute okay well I can't I can't shut it because I just don't have the patience for it right now it's actually not bad like it's pretty cute it's like um embroidered all right the next thing that I have are actually <sighs> Mascara ones, you can never have too much. I use this to spoolie out my eyebrows when I'm doing them, which by the way, my eyebrows are pretty subdued today. I have been trying to do the more natural looking and not so much the ones that I look like I'm going out to the club in the middle of the day. It's what I'm actually pretty excited about. It's this cute brush holder and it's acrylic. And I just really like the way it looks. And you guys know that I put all my stuff in either mason jars or like crystal containers that I find from like antiquing or thrift stores or whatnot. So this is plastic acrylic, so I like that a lot. Okay, next thing that I have is actually this fan brush. I buy a lot of brushes from eBay and I, I don't think I have ever had like really like really bad experience. Like sometimes it's really sparse, but honestly, like this is actually not a bad fan brush. Like that's not bad at all. And it's like a rose gold. So I'll go ahead and put that there always wash your brushes every time you get them from ebay just fyi since we're on the thing of brushes i got this brush which is like a real techniques dupe so yeah it's actually it feels really soft and then the last or this isn't the last brush but the last big brush is this is really cute i want to say this is a foundation brush but i just like how it was like ombre right here like that's super duper cute and then the next thing that i have are i thought this was was in a set of four but i guess it's just a set of three these are just three mini um eyeliner type of brushes i use these brushes not for eyeliner but for my eyebrows okay the next thing that i have are socks got a couple of socks here first one are these gray socks with little hearts on them i thought this was super cute and then this is actually like a little play on evian but it says okay on it and i just thought it was clever i guess i guess and then the last pair of socks that i have are actually these little cute little paws that cat paws socks like they have little paddings on the back oh my god that's so cute i got more lashes these are actually more sparse than the ones that i showed you earlier in the video but they remind me of sort of wispy lashes okay next thing that i have is this keychain actually i wanted to go ahead and buy this so that i can put it on my on my lanyard just so i can remember to remove my keys from my bag whenever i go on a flight because i do have mace on my bag not really sure what it says to tsa that i've been able to go in and out with my mace a couple of times so i don't know <laughs> but um yeah it just says remove before flight just a little keychain and that i have are actually this is the vamp stamp the only way to wing it and i believe you guys know what this is 
it's that little stamp that um well comes with eyeliner focus eyeliner a little brush i'm not sure i think this is to brush out some i don't know but you guys the vamp stamp there's that you can see it or not nah. but it comes with two different types of stamps for your wing liner and I've actually seen or not two types so one is left and one is right but I have seen so many reviews on this and I saw this and it was only for a dollar so I was like yes please I know I'm so late on stuff like this but this is the flower lipstick that has the flower on the inside Ooh. It looks so cool. It smells like an air freshener. Guess I can give it a try. Mess my lips up. Next thing that I have, it's the silicone beauty applicator and it's glittery. And again, there were so many reviews on different types of ways and things to apply your foundation. So I saw this and I was like, oh my God, that's cute. I can go ahead and try that out. Usually I take out a lot of these off of the plastics, but I, I guess I was lazy. Next thing that I have is a mini little beauty blender. Funny story is I thought this was a regular size, but I guess mini works. I can put that in my travel bag. Alrighty, next thing that I have are actually these scissors. These that. Scissors like this to um, trim my eyebrows. So I just really liked the color of it. It was super duper cute. It's like a like a metallic ombre. That would be a really cute nail polish. Next thing that I have is this super cute thing that looks like a leaf. But what you do is you put this in your bath, but you suction it to your um, the wall of your bathtub. And then what I want, want to go ahead and put people put um, toothbrushes, but I wanted to put my razor on here just because I just don't want it lying around. So yeah. Next thing that I have is a compact. Rose compact. There is that. You can see yourself. Super cute. I bought these. These things, you use them for when you wash your brushes to keep them together. This big brush. What you do is you open this up like so. Put the brush through it after you wash it, okay? And then what you go ahead and do is you do this so that the brush ha r retains its shape. That is not appropriate, Camille. <laughs> that hand gesture is horrible yeah it retains its shape so i got that for when i wash my brushes okay the next thing that i have is this cat line and you guys is actually really super duper cute so it is this little thing it's a stencil and it helps you so that you can do your eyeliner so there's a lot of stuff online like stencils and obviously this cat liner thing it's actually super duper cute do you like this type of line or this type of line it's actually pretty cool i i like that idea most people with trying to do eyeliner okay the next thing that i have is a weaving cap this is a little cap because i went through a phase where i was like i'm gonna buy some wigs yes i know camille why are you gonna buy wigs you have a lot of hair for the color uh, i i really want to go blonde but i'm so scared of the breakage so yeah so i just have this on hand just in case i decide to pull the trigger and get a wig this is a guam patch that i bought and if you guys don't know i was born in guam a little little tiny island of guam to moon in guam to be specific i decided when i went on my trips that i wanted to get patches so i was like you know what i'm gonna get guam patch because that's where i was from so yeah decided to buy that next thing that i have a little ring and no it's not for fashion i have depotted lipstick so if i want to mix it together i can just go ahead and get a spatula and just do a little mix here instead of using something else and wasting products so i thought that was pretty cool so this is, shoot, I forgot what this is called. It's like wire, it, it can cut through stuff. I'm gonna have to do some research cause I totally forgot what this is for, but I'm putting it in my hiking backpack just for the hell of it. Just in case, you know, you know, you never know. So weird, my, it stopped recording. Um, okay, anyways, so the rest of the things that I have on here are just jewelry. So I'm just gonna go, it real, go through it real quick. So the first thing that I have is actually this really cute choker. And I really like this pattern on it. Gosh, I have, I just cut my nails. So it's like, I have no grip whatsoever. Look at how cute that is. Okay, and then the next thing that I have is actually another choker. Now, when do you actually wear all this stuff? And the reason why I like this is because it was a choker and a necklace combined. So let me show you guys really quick. It's like this. 
So it's a choker and then it has a necklace at the bottom there. So I really like that. Okay, the next thing that I have are actually rings. These are a bunch of midi rings, you guys. I love rings. Anyways, this comes with six, but I have on three there and then three that are stuck together. So I'm super excited for this. Oh my God, it's so cute. So I have here a necklace and it's a sloth necklace. Oh, it's tangled, but I'll untangle it. But look at this. Focus on the sloth. Look how cute it is. He's just hanging. Alrighty. Oh, this is cute too. This is a ring and it's a ring of mountains. Let me just put it on really quick. Oh, am I not a size six anymore? Maybe I'm a size seven now. It looks a little, but there is, it's like little mountain ranges and I think that's super duper cute. And the last two things that I have are actually these rings. The way that I saw them when they were on eBay is that you take the rings and then you incorporate them into your braids so i have braids here so i forgot how they i think they did it before the braids and it was just like i have to do, i'll do a tutorial on this actually i wanted to see if i can actually get that done so Alrighty, so that is my eBay haul for now. I hope you guys like videos like this. If you guys did, go give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos by me, click that red subscribe button. It would totally make my day. And I will see you guys later. Bye! If you guys have any questions on how I get all this stuff, I actually have a fact video i'll try and link that down below or i'll have it on screen somewhere people always ask me to link stuff and honestly it's hard to link it because usually the vendors on ebay are like day by day sometimes they're not there sometimes they are sometimes they run out of stuff sometimes i just do the bidding instead of the buy it now so it's hard to link it so i'm sorry if you guys are requesting that what i would recommend is to just go ahead and do it in the search bar and see what you can find because that's ultimately what i do all right.